Hey, Benjamin Soma here. I wanted to explain an aspect of the chord player that might not be as intuitive, but when you grasp it, it will help you to play your chords much more like a real pianist. Now, of course, we know that pressing a pad will play that pad's notes of the chord, and then you let go, and those notes stop. Now, what if we were to play two pads with overlapping tones, and then let go of one of the pads? All the overlapped notes are stopped because they were part of this chord that got stopped. And all we have left is just the high note of this chord. Let me show you on the keyboard what just happened there. The first chord was this, and the second chord was this. So if we play them together, and then we stop the first chord, we're just left with that one note on top there. Now, what if we wanted to play a passage a little bit like this? Now, you heard that some of the chord tones got cut off there. Why did that happen? Well, the thing is that I was playing legato. I didn't actually let go of the prior pad before hitting the next. The thing is that a keyboardist only has so many fingers on their hand, so they're usually going to lift their hand in between each chord. So that's what I actually recommend you do on the chord player. Now you can get it to sound a little smoother like a legato by using the sustain pedal. Now you're going to have to look up this technique on your own, and you might need to practice a little if you don't already have it down. I know I did. But the idea for a pianist is you strike the note while the sustain pedal is lifted, and then before you lift your hand, you hold the sustain pedal, and then you can reposition your hand, and then simultaneously when you hit the next chord, you'll lift the sustain pedal. And then you can press it again before letting go of your chord. So that way you get the smoothness between each chord. So there you go. That's one way that will help you play your chords much more like a real pianist. You can find out more about the chord player at benjaminsoma.com. Enjoy.